Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be reviewing Hope by Hope Fragrances. This is what the bottle looks like. Um, the accords for this are white, floral, green, and fresh, and I would have to agree with all three of those. Um, the notes for this are, let's see, there's tuberose, lily of the valley, jasmine, and gardenia. Um, the only two flowers that I, I have a pretty good idea of what they smell like would be the jasmine and the gardenia. Um, I do smell jasmine in this. The gardenia, I, I think it's just well blended, but it doesn't stick out. Like, I love gardenia. It's one of my favorite perfume notes. Um, I love when a perfume is just straight out gardenia, like, um, uh, ooh, um, and of course my mind just went blank anyway. Um, <laughs> or I, I've also noticed that I also tend to like a lot of perfumes that have gardenia in it. Um, I have to admit that when I first sprayed this on, I wasn't too happy because for some reason I've convinced myself in my head that this was going to be a gardenia bomb and it just wasn't. And I was kind of disappointed. You know, I thought it smelled okay. Um, but I didn't really like it on the tester strip that much. Like I got three perfumes and I voted it number three. So, and I really didn't think that I was going to like it once I sprayed it on my skin, but I sprayed it on, I tried it and you know what? I really like it. I kind of fell in love with it. Um, it just has an overall floral smell. It's very floral, very white floral, and it has, um, a very nice greenness to it. It's very fresh. It's very, um, it's crisp and it's just very green. Um, let's see. I would, this is a very springy scent. Um, you could wear this in summer too, but this just reminds me of spring. And for me, this would be like an everyday, like at the office kind of smell. And it has like, I don't know if this is going to make sense to anyone else except me, but this has like a classic perfumey kind of smell. Um, I know that they're all perfumes, so therefore they all smell like perfumes, but there's certain scents that just like when you think of like just perfume, it kind of brings up that image. To me, this is one of those smells. It just has like a classic perfumey smell. Hopefully that makes sense. I'm sorry if it doesn't. Um, this probably is the first one and they have other flankers. Um, I have the night one, which I will also be reviewing. Um, let's see how there's, this came out in 2018 and let's see, I would totally give this as a gift. I think this is general enough, um, and easy enough to wear that I think I think a lot of people could probably pull it off. Um, would I buy a whole bottle of this? I would. I would. And I'm not usually um, a floral person. I usually like uh, gourmand or like really heavy, spicy scents. I'm not really a big fan of like super floral fragrances, but um, I really did like this one. And I was really surprised because I didn't really care for for the smell of it when I put it on the testing strip. But um, yeah, I was pleasantly surprised and I think that's all I have. Um, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe and leave a comment down below if you'd like. Bye.